I do like it. It's, it's basically team move speed versus two teleports here. Snoopy could get himself caught here, though, because Dominic didn't leave the jungle. Snoopy's in trouble. It's going to be bad. He gets hit up. His path is not clear anymore as they put the pillar down, and he actually delivers. Blue buff. Re oh, Cop and Bunny Fufu may have a level 6 advantage when it comes time. Boy uh -oh. Boy, not in a good position. Force the flash as he comes up on level 5 there. He'll be safe for the time being, but they'll come back for that flash down before he hits 6. Another hook. Yellow Pete getting low. Under he misses the Peacemaker combo. That could have actually been a kill right there, Cop. All right, mid, though, we do have uh, Dominate right up next to him, level six. Cobalter throws on the ultimate. You cannot take Riven for granted. That's a lot of AD that she gets for free when she pops that sword. And they're going to be able to get out on the win. Negative. Oh, boy, boy, could be the in danger binding! here. He still has the Rift Walk, though. Is he going to be able to get out? Wind Slash coming up big time for the backside Whoa. of boy, boy. Crepo with the robe up. Two mid getting a binding on the on the Cassid in there. Huge. Man, are they gonna go for the turret? Yes, they can change turret and then retain control of bottom lane. They've sent Pete back already. That is huge movement. That was a level boy getting a little bit of damage on Quas, not using his trinket in the top lane. It's gonna get hit up in a 2v1 situation. Cop as well in the bottom lane. A few more attacks. Teleport the barrier goes down. In. They get it. They take down Cop. Quas is still in the 2v1, and he will go down valiantly, trying what? to do the amount of damage that he can. But that <laughs> fight chased too far into the turret. And we see Dominate coming up with a cleanup. Uh, I'm pretty sure we're gonna get a replay of that. Yeah. But Boy super hard into the turret to stop the teleport and kill Boy Boy. Cost him his life, but. He stopped the other one. Finished Spite up on Wars. the yellow Pete. Oh, teleport coming in. They see it in the bush. A double pop up from the vault. Will they still be able to go in? What a pillar coming from Quas once again, causing them to shift around and find a new path out. They're still going to go into Snoopy. Ragnarok going to wear off in just a few. Cast one it blow in, in. You can't get away from Cast. There we go. Slowing him down. Getting that Void Pulse in, or Force Pulse rather. The Null Spheres to come out. Who's they going to give it to? They're kind of like, who wants it? Who wants it? Void Boy wants it. There he goes. They were waiting for the Rift to come up. He gets the charge in, and he gets the kill. Too. In this counter gank, uh, it depends on the burst. If they can burst down the target here for Curse. Oh, looks like Dominate gets the ball breaker. Whoa, what a chaotic fight to start this one off. They are going finally on to Yellow Pete, but no, now they want another one. Krepo gets hooked up a little bit here. Snoopy finally goes down. Krepo's oh, now going to be the focus, and it does not. Dominate takes the triple kill away, but they do take down all three in the bottom lane. What? Loop around by Dominate. Trying to trap EG. Oh, very nice grab coming in. A little bit of chaos caused by Boy Boy's Rift and that caused them to split in different Whoa. directions. But one for one going very quickly. That's gonna be Bunny Fufu going down. Snoopy very low on the backside and he gets drilled into the ground by I Will Dominate. Yellow Pete may not be able to get out of this one. There is no red buff on Dominate, but he's gonna have the Vault Breaker, a pillar for Quas possibly. Blow. They are so close, cop. Oh, he doesn't get a piece on the end. Neither does Quas. And it looks like another binding going to stop him in their tracks, though. That Three, cast. four, yep. two. EG used a lot of focus to take out Cassidy. And whoa, oh. Krepo playing with fire. Oh! And he gets burned. Yeah, sometimes you got to watch. So there's a giant wave up top for Kurt. Knox. And they're going to keep going on oh. that. They apply more damage. They get one alt out of that. See if they can punish this with a dragon. Poor boy chugging potions. He'll be right back up, so... Not only does Simba use his ult, but he's below 50% life. Oh, Bunny Foo Foo getting in range. Oh, the synergy coming in from the Cassidy and the Thresh being in range, one after the other for Curse. They now lock down on a Crepo. He can only do so much with a Soul Shackle on one, two, three. Pobelter's got the damage, but no! Boy Boy now coming in, and he is going to help to clean up the Yellow fight. Pete one, two, life. three, one last time, but no, he's rifted out. But Cassidy. All right, they but can't. Towards the top side of the jungle, but he throws down got Domain, the pillar. so they know where he's coming from. It may have been a little early. They throw down on the hunt. Boy Boy's in. The Zanyas is there. It's going to be Pobelter flashing in and stunning the entire team, Ooh. or at least trying to get three. It is a big fight, and that's what they needed the damage on Boy Boy, but he's still allowed to get back into this. It may have been enough on the initial engage. Two for one so far. Crepo <laughs> getting stuck up. Nice spell shield, actually. Whoa, Yellow Pete on the front line! That was a flash coming in. Not going to be coming out much of that. Yellow Pete gets himself the safety, but Boy Boy's in. Tries to get out of the hook onto Snoopy. Ragnarok is down. Got ults going for ults here. 
Bunny Fufu throws down the box, but Curse is on the backside, assessing the fight. Who do they kill next? Ace in the hole. Double Nobody kill coming for in. Curse. The a double, Barrett. double kill. No, we got Vise over Caitlyn's. It's a full house. Whoa, they just got wrecked in this team fight. All right, so Boy Boy again with the Zanya's initiate here. Goes in on Cassidy. Immediate Zanya's. It only dodges the axe, but that's enough. They get the Ragnarok from the hook from Bunny Fufu. They focus Pavelter, kill him first. Even though Dominate uh, gets really low from this, the burst coming back out. Man, Cop really getting to free fire on Caitlyn. Cop put out so much damage that fight. It's ridiculous. It only took a eight few and an eight. Cop as well. They can easily take this one and then go for an engage. 35 minutes in, three of four dragons in the game, two barons. He's in the hole coming out. Whoa, almost taking him down. They get the rift walk into Zanya's. And Classy. Boy Boy is going to be in there with the team. Classy indeed. This could be the inhibitor turret and trying to gain the lanes, but Curse was just able to swing it in their mid game and continue the snowball that we see now. Dominate. Looks like he wants to stay on the turret. Oh, here comes the engage. On the hunt. Talisman as well. Everybody is speeding around, but that doesn't look like the coordination is there for the rest of the fight. It's a 2v1. Nobody's helping Pole Belter in this. Everybody's trying to kite out and the disengage. Pole Belter goes down. They can still wait under the turret for the fight here. Two down for Evil Genius. Is now three as Poe Belter falls. It's going to be Bunny Foo Foo for the task, oh! but it's all right. Good hit up there. Hill coming in onto Inox. That's going to be the base. Our final game of Super Week as the Nexus gets crushed down. Goes to Curse. Congratulations, Team Curse. Another well deserved win. Dump. Didn't take advantage of it because Curse didn't let them. EG did try to get under their skin. They did as much as possible. We have Poe Belter trying to flash initiate.